So the Kenya Red Cross is doing a blood donation campaign that is dubbed Show Your Love Blood Drive. And yet to tell us more about this is the head of blood donor services, the Kenya National Blood Transfusion Services, Joseph Mirera. Welcome to the show. Thank you. Santi Sana Kwakuja. This is, we, we focus on, you know, love things and we'll be talking about that. Yes. And this blood drive this particular month is just for us to show that we love by donating our blood. And this is what the, uh, the Kenya National Blood Transfusion Services is all about. Yes. Maybe you can tell us more about that, what it does. Yeah, maybe I'll start by mm. uh, introducing uh, mm -hmm. uh, my organization. Mm -hmm. That's the Kenya National Blood Transfusion Service. Yes. This is a department within the Ministry of Health. Mm -hmm. And uh, we are stationed at National Public Health uh, Grounds opposite Kenyatta National Hospital. And basically, as a department of the ministry, we are charged with the mandate of uh, ensuring that Kenyans have safe and adequate blood for those who need it. Um, according to the World Health Organization, yeah. estimates of one percent, getting one percent uh, blood for, for, for population, mm -hmm. uh, now we are talking of uh, Kenya needing approximately 500,000 units of blood wow. every year. But it goes beyond that because mm -hmm. um, uh, th the needs depend on a number of factors. Of course, those who need blood, they are quite uh, uh, a, a cross section. You know, mothers who do maybe want to go for a cesarean section, those who could be involved in a road traffic accident, unfortunately, yeah. those with low hemoglobin, uh, the, the, the anemias, uh, the, the, the young kids, and, and, and that kind of uh, a person, those going for surgeries. So um, our actual blood requirement, you'd find that it actually goes beyond even the 500,000 yeah, yeah. um, units. Now, as a country, we have always fell short of this. Uh, we, we find uh, people are rarely eager to donate blood, especially when all is calm. But if you hear like there is a mishap somewhere, like mm -hmm. they do they, this with two, the, the bomb blast, yeah. guys come until our banks overflow. Yes, yes. And those are not planned for. It's something imekuja to imetupata sisi. Exactly. Mm. But now when we want to plan and ensure that we have adequate blood in our banks so that when you need blood, you get it. Because unfortunately, uh, every time somebody need, needs blood, it is yeah. more of an emergency yes. than anything else. It's true. So that blood is required ready. Mm. And I think what we also need to put into account is that uh, you never know when you require blood. Me and you, we could be talking here, but in the next minute, we you would know, require blood. Know, it's true. So we, it is actually a, a wake-up call that we are urging Kenyans to constantly have that culture. To donate blood. To donate blood. Yes. Now, um, coming uh, closer now to the blood drive that we are planning mm -hmm. uh, for the 12th, uh, 13th and 14th. Yes. This blood is, uh, the, the, the blood drive is dubbed as a, a Valentine's blood drive. Mm. And the theme is show your love, share life, donate blood. Oh, wow. And, you know, just to take you back, Kidogo, before we get to the, to the drive that is happening this weekend. Yes. Uh, what, what are the requirements for anybody out there who would like to donate their blood, but mm. so how do we know then that I am healthy enough yes. to be able to donate blood? Yes, um, it's, 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 it's simple and easy. Um, the most important thing is that you have to be between the age of 16 ah. and uh, 65. Okay. Above 16 and above, mm -hmm. uh, 65 and below. Mm -hmm. uh, you have to look healthy. I'm saying look healthy because healthy itself is very relative. That's true. Yeah, so uh, once you are within that age bracket and you, you're, health, uh, you're healthy looking, mm -hmm. um, once you come now to the, the, the donor clinic, yes. we have now what you call a donor clinic, that area where now you lie in a couch and, uh, and, 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 and you are bled. Yes. So before you reach that point, there is what we call now donor selection. Ah, so yeah. you pass through a counselor mm -hmm. um, who will give you a lot of information about blood. Then they'll ask you a lot of questions to just uh, assess your health status. Mm -hmm. Like, for example, 
females who are on their menstrual uh, yes. period. Uh, it's a very important uh, question that they need to understand yes, or know yes. to get a correct answer from you. Yeah, so if, you, if you're, uh, you've had a blood transfusion before, yes. uh, if, if you've, you had some surgery of a kind, mm. to mention but just a few. Yes. So that system uh, of donor selection then now will um, uh, let you now let us know whether you have met all the criteria. There are quite a number. We may not exhaust. Okay. But the most important thing is the age. And you, you, have, you have to feel, you see, there's that feeling that I'm, I am healthy. I'm healthy. Yes. But then now the, 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 the proof will lie on the kind of questions that, that you're uh, asked. Yeah. Plus, uh, oh, oh, and including maybe if you had uh, uh, sexual intercourse, maybe in, in, in the last like about two weeks. Mm, that is also a determining factor. Yes. Okay. B because we, we uh, as, as we progress, we will ask, I'll uh, uh, let uh, you know uh, briefly then what happens after this blood has been donated. Okay. But that is really what happens. We do recruitment uh, drives. We tell people come donate blood this age and that age and mm. a, a few of what I've said. Yes. And then now when you get to the, 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 the donor clinic area now, the proper donor selection starts. Happens, yes. yes. Pregnant women, are they allowed to do this? No. No, they are not allowed they, they, to They do are this. not in the category. Okay, okay. Mm. So after that, um, you get in and you, do, do, at that point, do they check what uh, type of your blood, what type of blood that is? Or they just take the blood and then they'll figure it out yes. after you've already donated your blood? Thank you for that question. At the donor clinic, uh, the, 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 the basically, you will donate that blood. Once that blood is donated, then it goes to our laboratory. Okay. And in the laboratory, we will determine your blood group. At the laboratory, we are also looking for what you call transfusion transmissible infections. Okay. Those are infections that you can actually get when you are transfused blood of somebody who has those infections. Mm. And basically what we are keen on are hep uh, hepatitis uh, B and e. C. Mm -hmm. We are looking at uh, syphilis. Mm -hmm. Uh, am, am, among others. Yeah. So those ones we test. Yes. And uh, if we find that you have any of that, then that blood would be discarded at that point. Okay. So it is from the same point that the uh, point that now you, you are, your blood group then is determined. Ah, is yeah. this information then uh, disseminated back to the donor? Maybe they did not know they have such conditions yes. or they did not know what their blood type is. Is this information given back to them? Exactly. Now, after you have donated your blood, you go. Yes. Then once this blood has been gone through the laboratory and it has been tested, mm -hmm. then we will get back to you. We will call you back. And ideally, every donor needs to be called back yeah. so that we discuss with you. One of the, the issues, of course, would be now the aspect of uh, the blood group. Mm -hmm. the, if we found you, for example, with the transfusion transmissible infection, yes. then you go through what we call counseling and care. And, and, and at, our, at our sites, mm -hmm. what we we'll do is uh, divide the, prepare you, divide the information to you. And because we, the, the part of treatment is not within our mandate, mm. then we'll refer you to an appropriate... Ah. Uh, institution, again of your choice, will give you a variety. Okay. Then you pick from that variety where you would want to go for treatment. Oh. Yeah. And once you have gone for treatment and you have healed, you could still come and donate. And donate blood. again. Yes. Because it's the same process again. The screening will happen yes. and so that you have, whatever you have in the blood banks mm. is healthy blood for people who will actually need it. Exactly. Uh, if you have any questions about blood donation, this is the time you can send that in triple one triple four triple one, and all you need is one shilling to do that. Find us on social media, Switch TV KE on Instagram, Switch TV Kenya on Facebook. I know there are many jokes about donating blood and the, the soda and the mukate that used to come with it and the glucose but we'll be talking about all of that in a bit. Don't go too far. This is Full Circle with Wikali. Welcome back to Full Circle with Mikali. It is the month of love. It's February, guys. I'm going to be saying happy Valentine's till we get to Valentine's Day. Why not? So happy Valentine's to all of you. And because I think, I feel 
and I know that I'm really, really nice. I just want to give you guys something to celebrate, especially the ladies out there. So Bit Nowhere is giving away two amazing outfits to two gorgeous ladies. And all I have to do is say why you need that dress for Valentine's Day. Why do you need Bit Nowhere to dress you for Valentine's Day? And just go onto their social media at Bit Nowhere ke and follow them so just make sure you follow them and you tell us why you need to be dressed on valentine's day what is so special about the, that day for you so go right ahead and do just that tell us why and follow them on their social media that is at bit nowhere ke all right talking about love we are talking about donating blood and this particular campaign is dubbed show your love blood drive kenya red cross is on top of this and in studio we have joseph mirare who's been giving us the do's don'ts the requirements of you being able to donate because that's what we're going to be doing this weekend right so we've gone through up to just we've gone up to where i've already donated yes. i've been given feedback and if i need treatment you've also given me direction yes. on where to get treatment Correct. so let's talk about the after donating what are the do's and don'ts of um, the donor after memaliza kupatiana damu oh great question um blood donation by the way is uh, is not a very complicated uh, uh, exercise it takes like about about 10 to 12 minutes mm -hmm. and and basically of course before you get to the actual donation we will test your your, your, your hemoglobin that we want to be sure now the amount of blood that you have because if you, again we, you could be healthy in every other aspect but if you, you you don't have enough blood then we're not going to bleed you yeah so we quickly uh, test for your hem hemoglobin. hb hemoglobin mm -hmm. and, and 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 then from there you now move to the coach itself okay and at the coach of course as, as you go along a lot of information is shared with you any fears because you, you, you want you by the time we are starting this the actual uh, bleeding, you are relaxed, you are calm. Yes. Yeah, then um, after you are done with the donation, of course, what we get from you is not more than 450 mils of blood. Ah, okay, yes. okay. Yeah, and, 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 and then after that, we, you, you are expected to rest maybe for like about 10, 15 minutes. Okay. Uh, the importance of this is that, you see, when blood comes out of your system, you are missing some volume. Yes. So if uh, immediately you wake up immediately after uh, the donation, you can get a shock of a kind. Okay. Yes. So we will allow you to to relax a little bit so that your body adjusts to that volume which has been removed. Mm -hmm. And and then um, after that, in order to reinforce that uh, the, the the volume even more, mm -hmm. you are given uh, soda. a soda or glucose. Yeah, glucose for energy. Yeah. Of course, we give you bread, biscuits. <laughs> <laughs> that is so true. I remember in college there, we could end up for easy bit of in and you party a soda. Yes. Umeka, 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 the whole day on yes. a lunch, and then there were you'd find these clinics all over in town yes. uh, and anybody was allowed to just walk in and do that right. now let's talk about the show your love blood drive yes. when it's happening it's happening mm. for a couple of days mm. where will it be what are the details to this yeah so um just before we get into this Mikali, mm. I, I want to say something okay that uh, blood donation goes throughout the year yes we have our static sites mm -hmm. we have um about we have six regional blood transfusion centers okay. across the country. Oh, wow. We have one in Nairobi just next to our office at the National Public Health Grounds. Mm -hmm. We have one in Mombasa. Mm -hmm. uh, then we have another one in Embu, uh, Kisumu, Eldoret. And uh, I don't know which one I've forgotten. I've talked of uh, Nairobi, Mombasa, Mombasa Kisumu, Embu, Kisumu, Eldoret. Eldoret. There's one more. Yeah, I'll remember that. Mm -hmm. So in, 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 in all these blood uh, transfusion centers, um, you can walk in any time and, and donate blood. Other than that, we have 27 ah. uh, satellites. Now, there's a difference between a, blood, a regional blood transfusion center and a satellite. What is that? The satellite is charged with the mandate of only collecting that blood. Once blood is, 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 is collected, then they, they, they have no capacity to test. So the testing then is, 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 is done at the, they take a sample 
to the regional blood transfusion center where it is tested. The blood okay. doesn't go, it's only the sample. Mm. Then the result is laid to them, relayed okay. to them. So any Kenyan can walk into any of those, and they're spread all, all over the country. They can walk in uh, any of uh, those facilities mm -hmm. and donate blood. Okay. Uh, plus, of course, we normally have uh, planned drives, maybe with institutions like we could say we are coming here and the employees, they are willing to donate blood. We will come to that place uh, uh, after we have done the, the nitty gritty of the arrangement mm -hmm. and, and still get that blood donated. And you can be invited anywhere by whatever community? Anywhere by whatever community, okay. even churches. Yes. We, 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 whichever place that we can get blood, we do that uh, routinely. Mm, okay. But this particular one is very special. Uh, because of uh, the love attached to it. Yes. And, 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 and like they say, of course, uh, in, in my vernacular, which I would not want to, but they say love is blood. Yes. So we, we, we want to try this because if you really um, full of love and you want to share it out, yes. what a better way you then, do it than, than sharing, sharing your blood. blood with somebody who needs it. Absolutely. Yes. I am totally for it. And I love that you, you uh, it was uh, dubbed that uh, show your love blood drive and it's in the month of February. It's going to be just before Valentine's Day. I think yes. it's going on from the 12th. Yeah. So it, it's, 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 it's starting from the 12th uh, through to the 14th. Okay. All, now, all the way to Valentine's Day. All the way to Valentine's Day. Mm -hmm. uh, on the 14th, we shall have the main event at um, Kenyatta International Sp uh, KICC mm -hmm. Kenyatta International Convention Center yes and we expect uh, none other than our uh, cabinet secretary to come and grace the event oh wow but before this happens yes uh, tomorrow just right uh, at the compound of our offices we shall um, have an engagement mm -hmm. with uh, the media mm -hmm. and uh, we shall also reward our highest uh, blood donors, male and female. Our female blood donor is called Aisha Dafala. Oh, wow. And uh, the, the, the male is Kennedy Sanya. So, so what does that mean? They have donated for a long time consistently. Consistently and, and the highest in terms of the number of times they have donated. Ah, okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yeah, and I think uh, w w w w it is at this point it is important to indicate yes. that... Uh, um, for the females, mm -hmm. they take four months before another, uh, they, they can donate again. And, and for the males, they take three months. Okay. Yes. So Aisha Dafala has done it, uh, I think, almost the 65th time. What? And uh, the other guy, cl following, following very, very closely. Closely, yes. So tomorrow we shall have that uh, ceremony and we, would, uh, we are expecting our cabinet secretary to, to honor them with the certificate of appreci appreciation yeah. for having contributed to this worthy cause. Oh my goodness. So blood. that is happening tomorrow. Tomorrow. And all. then for the blood drive itself, yes. where will the different centers be at for people to just make sure that they stream in in large numbers to yes. uh, you know, make their donations? Yes, we, we, we have uh, this happening in uh, about 16 counties. Mm -hmm. And um, in Nairobi, Nairobi, we have like about one, two, three, four, five, six sites. We have the KICC, mm -hmm. where we will uh, have the, the peak of the event on the 14th. Yes. Uh, then we, we have Kenyatta National Hospital, so you could actually walk into Kenyatta National Hospital and donate. We have MP Shah Hospital in Nairobi. Mm -hmm. We have uh, Aga Khan Hospital in Nairobi, uh, Mama Lucy Kibaki, and uh, Ongata Rungai. So that those are the, 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 the sites where you could actually walk in, and in, in within Nairobi and donate blood. Okay. The other county is Machakos, mm -hmm. and in Machakos we have Mulumutisia Gardens in Machakos Town. Yeah, we have the Great Wall Mall in Athi River, and we have Kangundo Hospital Grounds. Okay, in Makweni we have one site that is the Green Park uh, Mall in in Makweni County. In Kisi County, we have uh, two sites. Huduma Center in Kisi, mm -hmm. and uh, an, another one at Huduma Center in Nyamira. So you could actually walk in, uh, those are two counties actually, both Kisi and, uh, and, 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 and Nyamira, mm -hmm. to the Huduma Centers and, and get to donate blood. Now in Kakamega County, mm -hmm. 
we will have uh, Masinde Mulilo University grounds, uh, then Masinde Mulilo Gardens, the famous Masinde Mulilo Gardens, yes. uh, Sigalagala Polytechnic. So those are the three places where we shall have uh, our sites in Kakamega County. Okay. In Wasingishu County, we will have a telecom grounds in town center. We shall have our regional blood transfusion center grounds in Eldoret, where our, our, our center is. Yes. We will also be a site where you could walk in and uh, donate blood. Yeah. Then in Kuali County, mm -hmm. we have two sites. Mm -hmm. That is uh, Kinondo Kwetu Clinic, and we also have the Naiva Supermarket premises. Now moving to Embu. Yes. In Embu, we have uh, one site. That is the, the site is at uh, Jatomi Supermarket Grounds okay. in Embu. Mm -hmm. But we also have another site in Muranga, mm -hmm. but being managed by, by our, our staff uh, from um, Regional Blood Transfusion Center Embu yes. at uh, Ihura Stadium okay. in Muranga. Okay. Now, in Meru Isiolo counties, mm -hmm. We will have one. Uh, we ha we love Meru uh, at Meru and super, um, at Science Grounds, and another one within Isiolo Town. Then Nakuru, that is now the other the, the other regional ah, blood transfusion yes, center. Ah yes, yes, we'd forgotten. Yes. Yes. So Nakuru is also one of our regional blood transfusion center, uh -huh. and that forms the sixth. Yes. We will have uh, three sites: uh, Standard Chartered Bank parking mm -hmm. at the, within Nakuru Town. Mm -hmm. ACK Cathedral Church opposite uh, Central Police Station within Nakuru. Mm -hmm. And then we'll have another one in Naivasha at Sarah Center next to NNUS uh, bus stage that is within Naivasha. Okay. In Mombasa County, we shall have one at the Kenya Ferry Ground, mm -hmm. another one at the Te Technical University of uh, Mombasa, uh, the Third and the last uh, site will be at the Mamangina grounds. Ah. Now, in Migori County, mm -hmm. we shall have poster grounds hosting a site mm -hmm. and also the Kenya Medical Tra Training Center in Migori. In Bomet County, we shall have Longisa, Longisa County Referral Hospital as a place where you could walk in and donate during that period. In Nyeri, we have uh, the Whispers Park grounds mm -hmm. and we will also have the Kenya Medical Training college uh, near the grounds yeah in narrow county mm -hmm. we shall have uh, one at naivas grounds and finally in uh, transoya county there will be one at the revenue building in kitale but i want to state uh, here that those are the sites where we will be hyping for this yes and and these are sites which we will be supervising mm. directly from the national level yeah otherwise remember the 37 uh, sites I talked about. Yes. The six centers, I mean the, the 33, the six centers and the the 27 uh, satellites. Satellites. You could walk into any of our satellites and you still contribute, do, donate blood. Absolutely. Yes. This looks like a very powered up, uh, you know, event with a culmination that's going to happen at the KICC. Correct. That will be on the 14th. What oh. are the timelines for that for anybody who wants? Is it open to the public as well to just be there to celebrate love, you know? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. um, as these events continue, uh, for, for, for the celebrations and whatever it is. Yes. Remember, our main business is blood. Yes. So we want you to come there. Yeah. Join the rest of the others. But remember that blood donation will also be contri co continuing, continuing yes. as these ceremonies uh, happen as happen well. As so well. that will be a full day affair at the, at the KICC at on the, the 14th. At the KICC on the 14th. Okay. But uh, remember that for a blood donation from 12th to 14th, mm -hmm. we start at 8 and end when the last donor is bled. Ah, okay. Every day from 12th to 14th of February. I think it's such a beautiful event or some, such an honorable act mm. for everybody to just be part of. And uh, I'm looking forward to seeing uh, what will happen. Maybe in the Kuapo 12th, maybe 14th, Itakuwa Ngumu Kidogo. But just before that, you can do this, not for anything, but just to show your love. You don't know, itenda kwa nani hiyo blood, but unajua mm. unasaidia mtu. Kuna swali moja na sisi nataka probably Joseph Wende kabla tujajibu. Mtu anasema I have tattoos. I, will I be allowed to donate blood as well? Yes. 
but you will go through our the, the the screening as the, well the screening yes. and then uh, we will tell you if you are fit yes we'll say yes na kuna watu pia wanasema i nimeenda nikaambiwa i am underweight is it uh, is, is that a problem as well true that is something i think it's it's, it's, it's good that uh, a viewer has brought that uh, cause yes, yes. Uh, weight is very very important mm -hmm. if you are below 50 kgs okay then you 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 are you you, you will not be allowed to you'll not be allowed to donate to, to blood. donate so uh, weight is is actually also very important okay yeah. and at least we have a number there so 50 50 is the, and is the kgs we are looking yeah, for 50 and below 50 and below you will not be allowed yes thank you so much but if you're 16 you don't need an id to do this 16 and above and you're 50 50 kgs and above yes 65 and below yes then you're allowed to do you're this. allowed to donate correct wait yes. joseph asante sana kokoja it's been a very informative conversation that we have do you have something more yes okay mm -hmm. um I, I think it wouldn't be complete before I, I i want to thank our, our partners, partners yes across the board okay we have had an array of partners mm -hmm. but we we want to thank uh, kenya red cross society in a big way because um, kenya red cross society has always been with us it doesn't matter what time they have always come to partner with us in matters blood donation okay. whether it's a special occasion or not yes. so we want to thank them so much we want to thank uh, I, I would not mention but we have uh, over 20 partners uh -huh. who are coming all together to ensure that um, this exercise is a success absolutely yes. so memo tender to now moja for now and now we will thank water like yeah they, 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 they are quite a number <laughs> we have the rotary <laughs> club we have the li life bank we have uh, uh, lvct we have red splash we we we, we have amref we, we 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 have poster we so 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 many so many uh damusasa damusasa is very very key damusasa is doing a lot of for us in terms of even technology mm -hmm. and we want to thank them uh, very much plus everybody else who is putting in something in cash or in kind to just make sure that to this happens make sure that this exercise is a success okay and um, i want to appeal to kenyans yes that let us get into the culture of donating blood yeah. at any one time because you never know who that blood is going to that's true to to to, to help that's true Joseph Asante Sana Kokoja. And just to, you know, sum it up for you, the Kenya Red Cross is doing a campaign. It's dubbed Show Your Love Blood Drive from the twelfth to the from the twelfth through thirteenth and fourteenth of February. The campaign will be happening in eighteen counties where the call to action is getting people to donate blood. So take it upon yourself to just do that this Valentine's. We're taking a very short commercial break. We will be right back. This is full circle with Mukali. <laughs>